I'm glad we're kind of highlighting those areas so that it can be kind of clear and concise on what it means when we do actually talk about transparency and, and how we approach that. Coming from that, as we were just saying, that higher vibrational self-love approach, when we do that, when we change the habits, because it, it already takes enough effort to make an adjustment in your habits and in your life. So if we're going to do that, let's do it from a place that's actually going to be beneficial and loving and caring of the highest uh, vibrational love that we can have to actually instill something that can last us for a lifetime because we're never going to, we're not going to go through half our life and then just say, yeah, I already know myself. Yeah. That's good. No. I'm done. Yeah. I mean, that just doesn't, we can pretend, but then we're again, not being transparent and yeah. not being real, not being authentic and not being vulnerable. And then that's just ego, right? <laughs> Which is why we intertwine this all together. So, you know, it takes a lifetime to understand who we are because we are constantly exploring ourselves in who we are in every now moment. Yeah. And transparency is an incredible tool to help us understand that and be present and experience who we are at every level of self. Yeah. And this need to make everyone happy, mm. right? That will cut you off the knees with transparency and a heartbeat. Mm -hmm. Because if I'm being truly transparent and speaking my authentic voice and being open and honest, not only with myself, but the people around me, there are going to be some people who do not like what I have to say. Mm -hmm. And that's okay. I'm not asking everyone to agree with me, I'm not asking everyone to like me, and I'm definitely not asking everyone to believe me because we're all coming at this life from very different places. All I'm doing is being transparent in this is who I am and what you will hear from me is consistent. What you will see from me is consistent. I will show up in this fashion repeatedly. So not only am I showing you my authentic self, but I am being transparent in the way that I share that with you. And so when we do go back to that ego and that desire to be liked and loved by everyone, one thing I would say is we have to remember not everyone loves themselves, which makes it really challenging for them to love others. And so if we're seeking from the outside for everyone to love us, it will immediately shut down our ability to be transparent. That's a great point.